back thank you for that snapshot that's how i rap for the block so i'm down at new university if you ain't heard of me the flow's official get first phone with popsicles and a pencil and i saw the lip like nick jagger you guys got swagger ask my brother hercules spartan 300 shoot clear <laughs> Hercules, that's it. <laughs> All right, fellas. Who's that? I don't know what was that. There's the train. I'm not taking the train today. It's a nice sunny day today. It's been raining over the last few days. Don't be fooled by the sun. It's not hot. It's really windy. Like it's slowly getting colder day by day. I'll tell you about this on the way to college. So I'm actually planning to, you know, bike there. Would you look at my luck? There's one last bike standing there, and there's someone who's taking it. I guess I probably have to take the train now. I don't have any other choice. So the thing is, blue bikes were free this month. The reason being, the orange line is under construction, so to compensate for that, uh, the government of Massachusetts made blue bikes uh, free for everybody to use. Anyways, it's come down to the fact that I still have to take the train. So. Gosh, there are so many students. I was just walking around campus and I met Nikhil. He's also here for MEM. I was walking around and he recognized me. This is nice. Someone watching my videos for a long time. He's well, pros of being a YouTuber. Uh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> Anyways, uh, thanks bro. Welcome to the channel. Thanks. Bro. Also, all the best here. There are lockers that you can book for yourself. So, Northeastern has these uh, tunnels underground, which are actually used for the winters, like because it gets so ridiculously cold. There's a lot of lockers as well. So you can book a locker. All you have to do is go to the student hub, select housing and dining, go to Husky card preferences, and you know, book a locker for yourself. That's it. You know what I'm going to do? I'm going to go to the gym at 5.30 tomorrow morning and see how that works out. So far I've been going at 7. Once it started getting crowded I thought I'll go a little later so I went in the afternoon today and it was mad crowded. It was so crowded it took me two and a half hours to finish my workout. I'm going to try going at 5.30 from tomorrow. We'll see how that works out. Here's some more gyan that I can give to you for the day. So I'm sitting in the Snell library. The library. So this is a study room. If you're a new student here and you're wondering how you can get access to these study rooms, all you have to do is type on Google uh, Snell Library uh, Study Rooms or you know, it'll take you to a website where you can book either collab rooms which are on the first floor and the third floor, uh, like that is for more than one person or you can book a smaller room like this where one person can sit and get some work done. Seven fifty one AM. I wanted to record this yesterday, but I didn't get me a bike yesterday, and now I got me a bike today. So I'm gonna bike my way to the gym. It's cold. It's getting cold.
while i'm on my way to college i want to talk about part time jobs you know place like northeastern is definitely very difficult reason being there so many international students if you happen to be a new student and you are looking for part time jobs just think about the recruiter like think about how many people are there approaching them so i'm not saying it's impossible i'm just saying it's going to take you some time i'll make a more comprehensive video about it maybe you know get a couple more people to talk about it so you have a good idea of how things work this road is called huntington avenue where northeastern is and there's like three colleges on this very road there's massachusetts college of art and design there's wentworth which i just showed you and there's northeastern and that is the cory college of computer science there's also the museum of fine arts got done with the workout guess what it wasn't that crowded after all even though i went at like 8:30 9 o'clock it wasn't that crowded after all so nice job the weather is quite tricky yep it's playing uh, it's playing with us sure garden jacket it's getting cold it's so cold oh, oh you're wearing a t-shirt mm. this one came on old navy oh reban new yeah this video is officially not sponsored <laughs> no, by reban <laughs> fix it ah. Hi we're biking We're back on blue bikes So we're cycling all the way to north of Boston to go get a cake It's really called North End Yeah it is called North End uh, We're going back to Modern Pastry This is my third time there in the last 2 months I should probably get a free cake from them for this is the prudential center that's like one of the most uh, popular buildings in boston probably the most famous one in boston if you type the boston skyline you're going to see this building everywhere all this construction in the middle of the city of boston reminds me of bangalore Okay, Stuti. Take, take everyone in. Take everybody into Modern Pastry. Actually, get out the way first. Welcome <laughs> to Modern Pastry. If you're a fan of dessert pastry, anything Italian dessert, this is your pub. Or if you're a part um, of two. Just walk into, just walk into, and right on your door, you will see an extensive assortment of dessert spanning all the way across till the end, and then you go around, and then yeah, when, take a tour. While talking about cannolis, you can say, uh, for cannolis, go to Mike's Pastry. <laughs> Yeah, Pecanoli's Mike's Pastry is amazing. There's usually a long line, and they only take cash, so we prefer that. But yeah, amazing. And you get so many flavors. Stuti, you just walked into Modern Pastry and asked everybody to go to Mike's Pastry instead. One thing to keep in mind about Modern Pastry or Mike's Pastry, if you happen to come to Boston for that matter, they only take cash. They do not take cards. Le temps est bon. Le ciel. 
एंड वेलकम बैक टू द चैनल If you watch the Big Bang Theory, you've seen that Sheldon and Leonard have something called a roommate agreement, and that is exactly what we have here as well. It's interesting how our life revolves so much around Big Bang Theory, because we also have to climb four flights of stairs because there is no lift in this apartment. Now this is either going to be one amazing dish. or i'm going to completely blow it up there's only one way to find out so let's get to work it is a monsoon so don't be behind the camera bye everyone and this people of the internet is how you make pasta je suis à eux de la je suis have room at a payment so new dish will be made and it won't be repeated every week so no go get bored Okay. Have fun,